Dear single mom, there's something I really want to push out this morning and it's the fact that you are not disadvantaged. Yes, you heard me right. You are not in any way disadvantaged. And what does it mean? What does it mean to be disadvantaged? It means to be deprived of necessities of life or to feel socially below standard, of which you are not. Dear single mom, you are not socially below anybody. First, you may be thinking that other children have fathers, but your child or your children have none. The last time that I checked, God is still the father to the fatherless and the husband to the husbandless. Whether you're a widow, whether you're separated, whether you're divorced, it doesn't matter who you are. God is still there taking care of those children. He says in his word that he will mentor our children and great will be their peace. So you are not disadvantaged. You may look at married moms and social and feel socially out of place and think you don't match up. It's a lie. You are not in any way less of a mom or less of a woman because you are not married or because the other woman down the road or down the street is married and, and, and feels better than you know. We are all equal before God. The last time that I checked, who you are is not contingent on marriage, is not dependent on whether you are married or not. <laughs> you may feel unattractive and you think no man wants you, no man loves you, no man is looking direct in your direction. But it's a lie. There are some men, particularly married men, they wish you are the mother of their children or you are their wife. And they will look at you. So in that way, you are not disadvantaged. You're still beautiful. All you need to do is just believe that you are good. You are enough. Whether you are in the context of marriage or or not you are not disadvantaged so this morning i was coming back from school runs <laughs> this married man whom i know his wife and his two children that attend my children's school was looking at me like like <laughs> so i looked at myself and i said you are not in any way disadvantaged you may think as a single mom, you are doing too much. Oh, where is the father of these children? You're supposed to be here so that we can do everything together. But do you know what, that's, what that does for you? What that does for you is that it helps your brain to be at a lot, which is the only part of our body that keeps growing. It helps you to coordinate, to organize. It helps you to keep fit. It helps you to work out. You see, so again, you are not disadvantaged dear mom you are not disadvantaged in any way you know so with this few points of mine i hope i've been able to convince you and not confuse you dear single mom that you are not disadvantaged okay so have a lovely day take care now bye